Daniel, you need to see this. What is it? You've been keeping your career as a guitar player under wraps? What the? How is that even possible? Maybe the fog was the reason for the diversion. We were never meant to make it out of here. Can't see for shit. Oh, Jesus! The water looks black. I don't want to go anywhere near it. Okay. Who's first up? Huh. Professor? You keep telling us you're in charge, so... Maybe we need to check all our other options first. Right. Thought so. Come on. I want off this bridge as fast as possible. But not that fast. Someone has to go first. You lead. I'll be right behind you. Can't stay here. In this year of our Lord, sixteen hundred and ninety two, we are here present to bear witness to a just execution. No, Amy is declared guilty of consorting with the devil and is to be drowned as a witch and sorceress. Let us pray in silence for her soul. I've done no wrong. I am no witch. I do not deserve death. I beg you. What's going on? Why, why do you look like Angela? Your words have little meaning to me, but I beg you. Help me. The devil is in the wind, seeking to help his own. He would release her from the chains. Isaac, let us conclude our business here swiftly. The will of the court must be imposed before it's too late. The devil fortifies her. You must bind her tightly. You cannot do this! Isaac, I am innocent. fulfill the will of the court. Send this witch back into the lap of her master, lest he come for us all. Little Hope is already lost, shrouded in evil. But not as you claim from witchcraft or outside demons, we are poisoned from within. You will not save yourself with riddles. There is no riddle. The devil takes many forms. You know that better than any. If Little Hope has hid himself under a shroud of innocence, taken the form of a child by accuser. While Mary still draws breath, little hope remains beyond salvation. There lies your evil reference to your very fit! Isaac.
What did you see? Tell me. I don't know how to tell you what I just saw. Give us a moment here, will ya? We've just gone through something pretty tough. Tough in what way? I need a moment. All right, I'll go first. <clears throat> okay, you two, get on down here. We need to get out of here right now. Well, your group seems to have suffered a loss. That was terrible, but avoidable. You know that. You're aware of the expression, a fate worse than death. Never mind. Let's focus on the future, on those still present. As the stakes seem to have been elevated, that gun might prove to be a lifesaver. Don't you think? Or the precise opposite? Andrew is keeping it quiet. Good move. Look after number one, right? The boys have some interesting theories. Maybe you're choosing to believe Daniel's theory, that they're already dead. My dream was lengthened after life. Oh, then began the tempest to my soul. I passed, methought, the melancholy flood 
with that sour ferryman, which poets write of unto the kingdom of perpetual night. <laughs> it's possible, I suppose. Maybe the bus driver can shed some light. This must be very confusing for you right now. Doppelgangers, witches, ghosts, death and demons. What could possibly tie all of these souls together? I dare say we'll find out, hmm? I have been granted permission to give you a single hint. Tempted? <laughs> okay then, we will once again turn to the Bard for some cryptic inspiration. I met him once, you know. I meet everybody once. Act five, scene one, where Cleomenes begs Leontes to forgive himself for causing the death of Hermione. Do as the heavens have done. Forget your evil. With them, forgive yourself. Go on then. As terrifying as it might be, you should get back to it. Wait! What the fuck? I mean, what did that thing do to her? I think it drowned Angela. Dragged her under the water. Fuck. Breathe. Don't beat yourself up. I didn't know what to do. It all happened so fast. It's okay. You did everything you could. It's just you and me now. Until Taylor and Daniel get to us. Now more than ever, we need to have each other's back. Let's just get out of here.
Let's stay away from that bridge. Pretty sure Daniel and Taylor would be thinking the same thing. Out of sight, quick! Ah! Shit! Stupid old fool. Can I get some peace around here? Best to keep out of his way, I reckon. That woman's final words keep buzzing in my head. To end what's happening in Little Hope, the little girl has to be stopped. Was she talking about stopping more witchcraft accusations or something else? I couldn't tell. Come on, let's go. I'll go in and take a look around. I can't believe Angela's gone. I mean... What the fuck? It's... Tough for sure, but... Tougher on you. You two were pretty tight. I don't get why you're so torn up over Angela. Seems like you mostly hated her. I understand you're upset about Angela, which is why I'm gonna overlook that. noise didn't hear anything I don't like this I want to go another way don't think there is another way Hey, over here. You gotta check this out. That thing could still be around here. In the water. No, we left that thing way behind. We must have. Oh, shit. You're going first, right? You weigh half what I do. Better if you lead. I'm not crossing this crapped out bridge, no way. To find the others we got across. We got no choice. Fine. I'm heading across, you can follow me. If the bridge is still standing. Okay then. You see this? Let's get out of here. <gasps> Daniel! <gasps> get your hands off us! Quiet. I'll break you. Mary? Mary? Mary! I am over this way! Mary. The fountain of all evil. That little kid is the evil here? I don't I don't get it. My brother Amy proclaimed it so with her dying testimony. 
If this evil is to end, Mary must be stopped. Who in the hell are you? Why do you look just like John? I have no answers for you. Perhaps I'm already under a witch's spell. There it lies. I found it. How did you come by this? Fashioned with my own hand. I take it to protect you. Suspicion and betrayal walk side by side in Little Oak. No one is safe. Please, Tabitha, let me keep here. Nothing. No working phone anywhere. Okay, so it looks like we really are trapped here. Still no sign of them? Nope. Not yet. I just hope they're both okay. I figured we'd have found the bus driver by now. Wonder where he's at. <laughs> what do you think she wants with us? I... I think she wants us to go after her. The two girls we've seen. One is from the past. This one is from here and now. Maybe the girl we're seeing here is somehow a mirror image of the girl from the 17th century. Don't you want to wait for Daniel and Taylor? If they were coming this way, they'd be here by now. <laughs> Who knows what's up ahead? Hey! <laughs> There's something blocking the door. Give me a hand, will ya? This place is a museum of some kind. Is she in there? Relax. This doesn't feel right. Why is this kid out here on her own? It's strange. Maybe she's linked to Mary somehow? Gotta be. Though how and why, I'm not sure of yet. We can get out this way. Where'd that little girl get to? She let us in here and then disappeared. Maybe that was her plan all along. I'm not sure about that. Almost out of juice. No signal out here anyway. Where the hell are the others? Probably as lost as us. You think they're looking for us? Could be. The professor was real keen to get into town. What makes you think he's bothered about finding us? What are you talking about? If he finds help, is he really going to come back looking for us? Sure he will. He's probably looking for us as we speak. <sighs> oh. 
All right. Ten bucks says no one's home. I'm not touching that. Still, first place we've seen in a while. Find a way in? Like you found a way into that store? You a burglar in your spare time? <laughs> no. But I was in a past life. Hey, Taylor, check this out. Check what out? Don't think anyone's visited for a long time. Oh, yeah. And that's ten bucks you owe me. Don't owe you squat. I never took the uh, bet. Fair enough. It's loose. I can jimmy this open, no problem. <sighs> we could have a big powwow about who goes in first. But we both know what's gonna happen. Right. Sure thing. Whoa, what the? What? That's... Oh, Easy shit. now, tough guy. Don't beat up the scary doll. Funny. Get your ass in here. Come on, this way. These things look so real. They're freaking me out. What's up? I just, I just saw something. Where the hell are you going? You sure this is a good move? Nope. Taylor! You okay? What's going on? What happened? I heard voices. I saw my fucking self looking back at me, dressed all weird, speaking funny. I mean, what the fuck? Well, you go walking around on your own like that and shit happens. Fuck off, Daniel. I thought you had my back. This is so fucked up. This woman, the one who looked like me, they just dragged her out like some kind of criminal. I mean, shit. Let's get out of here. I hear that.
Come on, this way up. Hello. Are things becoming any clearer for you? Let me help you out. Give you one little hint. Well then, how can I put this? We each have our own demons. They are ours and ours alone, and they are often born out of regret. I'll leave you now with some wise words from a great Irish playwright I once met in uh, Paris, I believe. Never judge anyone shortly. Every saint has a past, and every sinner has a future. She's just a child. Let's speak again later. Looks like we've locked out here. <laughs>